Hey, it's Brian from iSpring, and today we're going to find out how to convert a PowerPoint presentation to a SCORM package. After watching this video, you'll know how to create a course from an ordinary presentation, add videos, interactions, and quizzes to your course, convert the course to SCORM with minimum fuss, and upload the course to your LMS. Step 1 is to prepare a presentation. You can create one from scratch or use one that you've already created. Don't hesitate to use animations, transitions, and triggers because they'll all be preserved after conversion to SCORM. Step 2 is to download a free fully functional trial of iSpring Suite here from the iSpring website and then go back to PowerPoint. You'll see iSpring Suite right up here on the toolbar. You can add a bunch of extra stuff like audio and video narrations, templates and characters from the content library, and e-learning content like quizzes, interactions, and simulations. For example, let me show you how to add an existing quiz. Just scroll down to where you want to add it, then insert a new slide, and click the quiz button on the iSpring toolbar. You can create a new quiz or survey here, or browse for a quiz on your computer right down here, but I'll just pick a recent quiz from this list. You can find out more about QuizMaker by watching the tutorials, but for now I'll just save it and return to the course. Now this placeholder appears on the slide, which means the quiz will be included when I publish. Speaking of which, that's the next step. I'll pick the LMS destination, and make sure zip output is checked, because LMSs only accept SCORM packages in zip format. Now here on the Learning Course tab, I'm going to pick SCORM 1.2, which is accepted by most LMSs. You might have to choose 2004, so check with your LMS before publishing. If you want, you can also customize progress and completion settings, and then go ahead and publish. Depending on the size of your course, it may take a little while, but it's usually pretty quick. Now here in the preview window, you can open the folder containing the SCORM package, then hold down the shift key on your keyboard, and click Copy as Path. The final step is to upload the file to an LMS of your choice. You can do that by pasting the path you just copied. This page on the iSpring website shows a list of LMSs that have been tested for perfect compatibility, and you can also see uploading instructions by clicking Learn More under an LMS, and then scrolling right down here and clicking Learn More again. And there you go! Thanks for watching! Now you're ready to convert your own PowerPoint presentation to a SCORM package. Did you like this video? Give it a like and subscribe to the iSpring YouTube channel for more updates.